whether you're handling still or carbonated beverages, marketing extended shelf life products without any preservatives and with minimized amount of thermal treatment, or in fact beverage variants from the entire pH spectrum and filling them in PET plastic bottles, there is no better choice than the PET ASEP-D process from Crohn's, an asepting filling technology featuring H2O2 sterilization. Besides this dry sterilization using H2O2, hydrogen peroxide in gaseous form, Crohn's also offers wet sterilization using parasitic acid in the sterilization process for bottles and closures. And this is how the PET ASEP-D process from Crohn's actually works. The aseptic filling technology featuring H2O2 sterilization. First of all, an aseptic filling line comprises three intermeshing steps. Bottle sterilization, filling, capping. Sealing off these process stages from their surroundings in an isolator kept at an appropriate overpressure enables the operating conditions to be controlled and monitored to optimum effect. Bottle sterilization. The bottles are passed into the sterilizer in neck handling mode. This can be done using an air conveyor or also an upstream monoblock synchronized blow molding machine. In a pre-warming zone, the containers are brought up to the requisite temperature. In the subsequent sterilization zone, the hydrogen peroxide gas, evaporated in central units and mixed with warmed up sterile air, is passed continuously into the bottle through a single channel nozzle. Since the bottle's surfaces have been warmed, there is no visible condensation. Depending on the line's rating and the size of the bottle involved, the treatment zones are designed for star wheel or carousel mode. The salient advantages are these. Continuous evaporation of the liquid hydrogen peroxide in central evaporators. Heated sterile air used as a carrier medium for the evaporated hydrogen peroxide. Dry disinfection of all bottle surfaces using gaseous hydrogen peroxide H2O2 plus effective exterior disinfection in an atmosphere comprising gaseous H2O2. Complete surface sterilization without any condensation or spray shadows. Maximized sterilization performance with minimized consumption of the sterilizing agent involved. Before the bottles are transferred to the filler, any residues of hydrogen peroxide are removed from them in the blowout zone using sterile air. This can be done at different temperatures. The cooling step, using colder air, ensures a stable filling process, since only bottles that are dimensionally stable are passed to the filler. Since Crohn's' hydrogen peroxide-based process does not produce any condensation, the FDA's limit value for residues is more than comfortably complied with. Filling. After the product has been gently sterilized, and the bottles too, the latter are now filled. The filling system concerned is chosen to suit the particular characteristics of the product involved. In addition to maximized hygiene, this also assures high precision filling accuracy. Stringent separation between the filling valve and the integrated machine components can be relied upon to prevent contaminations. As with all carousels, a water seal is used here to ensure hygienic separation between the sterile filling zone and its surroundings. Before the bottles are capped, a dropler passes liquid nitrogen into them, thus expelling the oxygen they contain. The product has a longer shelf life and the containers exhibit better dimensional stability. Capping. After the closures have been sterilized, either in a hydrogen peroxide process or in a parasitic acid immersion bath, the aseptic servo capper applies the bottle closures. The concept enables several closure disinfection units to be integrated in a single line so that a multiplicity of different closures can be handled, such as flat caps and sports caps, plus various neck widths as well.
The PET ASEP-D process from Crohn's. It's the perfect solution for aseptic filling. 